is the uh, BJP Chief Minister Dr. Pramod Sawant is going to tell him that people are angry on us. That is why we had to bring you to Bardesh. Now what has happened is, Prime Minister of the country never came to Bardesh. He always comes to national capital, addresses the people of the of the state, and he goes. So they bring him to Bardesh. So they know that um, Tiswadi and South Goa is gone from them. People have gone away. So they are trying to, uh, since Bardes they are getting negative response, no response, no proper response. People are unhappy. So they are only trying to go to uh, certain places in Bardes uh, to create an atmosphere that Prime Minister came to meet you. He's not come to meet you. <laughs> He's coming to campaign with the party. And the, the Goa BJP is, brought, is bringing him over there only for one reason that they are, they are, their ship is drifting. It has drifted from the ocean and it is coming and getting stuck in the rocks. So he is coming to repair that uh, damage, but that damage cannot be repaired only for one reason that what is the uh, chief minister going to tell the prime minister? What? I want to know. What is going to tell? The people of Bardes are angry because we sold jobs. People of Bardes are angry because we have not listened to them. We have gone against the wishes of the people of Goa. What are they going to tell? I also want to know. People of Goa want to know why why is uh, the Prime Minister coming to Bardes and not to national capital? Uh, sorry, uh, state capital. He always comes there to address the... Yeah the people. So they are, they know that they are scared. The the candidates of Bhartiya Janata Party are scared. So they are telling the Chief Minister to bring him to Bhartiya. Prime Minister coming will not change anything. People have decided to send the BJP candidates home. All seven seats they are going to lose. This is what the people have already decided. Is he coming to counter Michael Lobo's wave no, in Bardes? No, no, it's Did not Michael. It's a, it's a Congress wave in Bardes. And the Congress wave has come because uh, the BJP MLAs in the other constituencies have taken people for granted. Is the CM people, people are being taken for granted. The and they think that, uh, no, 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 yeah, are voter hai. these are my voters. As if the voters belong to them. Voters do not belong to anybody. It's, it, we have to be very, very uh, clear on this. Voters belong to themselves. Voters will decide whom they want to vote. If the government has done good work, they will vote for the government, the present BJP government. If the government has gone against the wishes of the people of Goa, why should Bardesh people vote for BJP? Tell me that reason. You go and look at Mapsa. Go and look at the coastal belt. There is no water. There is no proper electricity. We are talking about basic things. Water. For workers should not vote for BJP and teach uh, Rohan County a lesson. He was supposed to join Congress. He last minute he changed, thinking that BJP is coming to power. Now he has realized that he has made a biggest mistake. So there is no way for BJP. BJP is going to be minus ten, less than ten. The CM has brought the uh, Prime Minister to Mapsa to save his skin, or what it is? No, no. He knows that he is losing all seats. So, Prime Minister seat? coming, Prime Minister coming to Mapsa, is it going to change? Is it going to change the... Uh, he is going to come, address for two hours and go. Is, is, is LPG cylinder going to come down? Is the Mapsa development going to happen in 24 hours? Are the people of Mapsa going to get water? The footpaths, the required infrastructure in Mapsa? They have not done it. He was GSIDC uh, vice chairman. He's as good as the chairman. So, what Glenn Tiklo is going to tell? That the jobs were sold by Pawaskar and not by BJP. Is he going to tell his voters? Or Prime Minister is going to talk on his behalf? See, we respect the chair of the Prime Minister. We call him Honorable Prime Minister of the country. We respect him. But it doesn't mean that he's going to come and is, something is going to change in Bardes. Bardes have decided to vote against BJP. Thank you. Thank you.
And Congress has promised that petrol will become 20 rupees less from 100 to 80. This is our promise and we will deliver it. And petrol has to come down all over India. People's pockets are burning. Instead of the fuel burning, people's pockets are burning. So there is a major, uh, major problem all over India. And the government has to understand the difficulty of the people yeah. of India. We, Congress party, will reduce the petrol price by 20 rupees. Okay. Is, is the promise on our manifesto. So that's why, that, that, that's, that's why you are campaigning on a cycle? Yeah, right now I am campaigning on cycle. Petrol is expensive. Please help us for the Congress. Vote for Congress. Thank you, sir. 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 Thank you, sir.